We're also here today talking about the sour urine line in uh, Ryusin's lineup. So what sour urine means basically means blue or azure dragon and they did this beautiful um, resin handle so it's got the scales in there absolutely sets this knife apart from from other knives uh, it has a nice highly polished damascus blade the core is vg10 the damascus is a 67 layer damascus and then they ping the top of it and got a highly polish on it and even to the point where they did the same texture on the back of the pommel. Absolutely love that detail. Uh, one of those things that I absolutely love about this knife. Uh, they do these lovely little black lines in here, so they, they, they carve into there and then fill that with black epoxy. Um, so what knives are in this line? So the three knives that are currently in the Sour Urine line are the Gyoto. It's a 210 millimeter Gyoto, or about an eight and a quarter. The Santoku is 170 millimeters, so about six and three quarter inches. And the Petty is 135 millimeters, or about five and a quarter inches. Um, these knives are absolutely amazing. This isn't the highest end uh, knife that the Ryusin's, uh, Ryusin has in their lineup, um, but it is at least their second highest. These are beautiful knives. The edges on all of these are super cute. They're extremely thin. These are a little bit heavier than like the, the blazing lines just because it will have the pommel and the stainless steel uh, bolster up here. So they're gonna be a little bit heavier than like a super traditional wall handle, like wood wall handle knife, um, but they're still nice and lightweight and they feel absolutely amazing in the hand. So if you're interested in a unique Japanese made knife, take a look at the Sour Urine line by Ryusin at serenitynives.com. Thank you.